All you need to do now Just open the door, please Open the door I don't want to open the door for me You just open the door and... Oh! Hey, what's up everyone, Vortex here and welcome to the very first episode of a new horror game that we're gonna play here on this channel. And this game is called Summer of 58. I had to take a break from all these reaction videos that I, I was doing with ghosts and paranormal activities, creatures and aliens, whatever it was, you know. And I'm having a lot of fun doing those reaction videos, I'm gonna keep making those. But I felt the need to play some good horror games, right? This one, it's uh, apparently it's a very good horror game, and so uh, I'm gonna have a lot of fun, hopefully. Uh, I don't really know anything about the story. All I know it's like it's placed somewhere in Russia, I think. And you go there as a journalist and try to uh, find what happened with, I think, uh, some kids or something like that. I can't remember exactly. Uh, this game had a lot, quite a lot of uh, good reviews on uh, Steam from uh, other people. So I'm hoping that it's gonna be good, you know. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe. If you want to become members of my channel, just press the join button. And without further ado, let's play the game. All right. So <laughs> let's uh, let's get ready. All right. Sometimes people make up things that aren't there. It seems to them that some entity controls their mind and their life. They do terrible things that can drive you crazy. I don't believe in paranormal phenomena. I believe that the troubles that people commit are their own fault or those who brought them to this. And in order for you to believe your eyes and not fictions, to believe your eyes and not fiction, okay? I made revealing videos about paranormal phenomena in two houses in which, according to people's story, madness was happening. What was? My name was Alex and something like that. Ah, this is the... Wait, I I'm not playing the game. Right? No, I'm not playing the game. Is this a video that he was doing? This, uh... He's the obviously maybe he's a paranormal investigator, right? And these probably are videos from the from the houses that he was talking about. It was like a really creepy house here. Is this another game? Maybe it's another game from the same saga. I'm not sure. I searched all the corners, but I didn't find any evidence confir confirming paranormal activity in these houses. Now I'm going to an abandoned pioneer camp in Russia at the request of my subscribers to find out if the rumors that the locals have been talking about for so many years are true. Ah, okay. I they say that there are ghosts of dead people in this place at the hands of one of the residents. He himself was never found. The bodies of these people were also not found. Local residents avoid this place and those who were touched by this tragedy, do not allow to open the doors of this building in memory of the dead and missing. I came to Russia to investigate what happened, to find out if the rumors are true and to find evidence of this. In keeping with my tradition, I closed the doors of the building behind me so that there is no temptation to leave it. And I'm staying here for a few nights recording a report. I have a video camera, a sleeping bag, a backpack with things and food with me. Who's opening doors? Oh, okay. <laughs> I got scared for a second. All right. <laughs> okay, so... So we went to this place and now we are closed in for a couple of nights, right? All right. Uh, need to explore this camp. Is this the door that where I came through, right? And I blocked it. Why, why would anyone go inside the house, an abandoned house or whatever it is and close the door behind him okay what's this one i can't read what it says i need to get my russian english dictionary okay i don't have that one with me uh, is there a sprint button mm, somehow of a sprint but not not that sprinting uh, is the soyuz capsule okay uh, another picture of a kid here. A lot of toys. Okay, that's the outside. The out. What was that? 
Do I need to look through all this shit? I don't want to miss anything, you know? Alright, I don't think there's anything here. Oh, the fuse is blown. There is no light in the building, okay? Hmm. Ooh, Russian English Dictionary. Oh, okay. So, now we can read this one. An investigation is underway on the disappearance of children and employees of the Yunus Pioneer Camp, which was opened in 1955 under the leadership of director Maria Anta Anatolievna. The suspect it, in this case is a child living in this camp. The name is Yakov. A child? All right. Evidence of the victims was found in his locker. What happened to him and where he is now, it's not known. All right, I wasn't expecting a child to be the, the killer. I don't think there's any movement outside. Okay, let's uh, let's explore a little bit more. Can I close this door? No. All right, that's a creepy hallway. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anyone. What do I have here? I should probably... Do I have a lighter or something? No. I don't think so. Why there's all these uh, noises around me? I mean, obviously, it's an abandoned house. Oh, have a... I don't know. It looks like the outside. Maybe a park somewhere? Man, this game is a bit creepy, honestly. Oh, we have a crouch. There are legends that there was an orphanage near this camp and there lived a strange girl who was afraid of water. She did not wash and did not go on uh, to the river. One day the older girls decided to laugh at her, tied her hands and poured water over her. She was very scared and ran away. They couldn't find her for many days and they decided that she was dead. But one night she came back in her uh, pajamas, all wet and killed everyone who bullied her. After that, her spirit appears in the bathroom on a full moon. Um, okay. I don't think I want to be part of that story. <laughs> oh, this is the bathroom. So she's gonna appear here, right? Alright, um... What was the mission again? I think I have to explore this place, right? Oh, I have something here. What's this? Opening of an orphanage. I have a picture of kids and stuff here. 1944, whatever. Hmm. Very interesting, very interesting. Is there anything else here that I need to, to check? Okay, yeah, this uh, this is a bit better with... Because I want to make sure I, uh, I see everything, you know? Obviously, if I was playing by myself, I would have uh, the gamma down, but... Uh, it's not just for me, it's for you guys as well. I want you guys to uh, see any ghosts in corners or stuff like that, you know? So, I think uh, putting the, the gamma up is better. Okay, let's take... Ooh, nice idea. Happen. All right. Oh, there's something here as well. It's another picture of this 1946. A picture of people. Does this mean anything to the game? All these pictures. I'm not sure. Hello. Um, please don't start with the creepy stuff. All right, let's uh, let's go in here and see what we have here. Man, this is dark. Can we? 
Wait, can I use the lighter? How do I use the lighter? Mm, inventory? Any inventory? Anything? Lighter? F? L? Nothing. Okay. I have a lighter, but I can't use it for whatever reason. Alright, let's see. Let's go in here. I have a, one of these dolls here. I can't remember what their name is. Two blocked doors. A bunch of toys. Oh! Did someone feed the cats here? What cats? A train. I hear a train. Okay. Oh, look at this mask. Holy shit. Oh. Hey, kitty. These are cats here. Can I pet you? Oh, who's a good kitty? Who's a good kitty? Okay. Have a doll here. Is there anything that I need to check here? Or I'm just wasting my time? Okay. In 1958, towards the end of the summer, parents called the camp to find out if everything was alright with their children, but no one answered. When they arrived at the camp, they found no one, only abandoned things and a mess. All the locals helped in the search for the missing children, but all in vain. The... I, sorry, I guys, I had to pause the game. The sounds in this game are so good. Because uh, when I was reading, I stopped for a second because I thought I heard something around me, you know. But it's actually in the game and it sounds like it's right in behind you, you know. It's so good. I love this. Alright, <laughs> let's go back to the game. Um, okay, what do I do here now? There's still a train. Alright, is there anything again? I don't know if there's anything here that I need to to take. There's one and two cats here, but I don't know what's up with them. I'm trying to click on everything to see if I have to, to take something. Uh Hello? I think it's someone at the door. Excuse me, can I help you? Holy shit, that gave me fucking goosebumps. What's this? It's a toy? Um, hello? Okay. Whatever. Ignore that. Pretend like nothing happened. Okay, so what do I do now? I guess I'm gonna... Oh! Hey! How the hell did you get there? Is this the doll from there? Are you okay? Oh man, he's gonna jump on me, right? Um... Hello? You're a good guy, boy. Okay. Whatever. Just ignore him. And... I guess I go back there, here? Man, this is so dark in this corner. Ah! Um... I don't know what happened. Someone was uh, running behind me. I don't really want to go there. I think it's nothing. Okay. Uh, yes. I don't want to play with you. I'm sorry. I'm not in the mood for playing with balls. I, um... Maybe that was a bad idea to come here. Ah! What the fuck happened? Is the cat? Are the cats okay? Hey, kitty kitty! Hey, kitty kitty! Anything happened here? Um... Wait... 
Why there's the alarm? This is that um, when something dangerous is happening, like. Are we gonna die here in an explosion? It will be dark soon. No need to look for candles. Okay. Why not? Uh, hey. Are you the one walking around? Okay, let's take the candles. He took down the... What happened here? I don't understand what happened here. Where are the cats? The cats left. Okay. Ah, they knocked the box from here. Alright. I'm not sure... What do I do next? I would like to take these cigarettes, have my last smoke before I die in here. Okay, the alarm is stopping. Um, I'm, I'm not sure what to do. Alright, creepy sounds. I can light the candles now. Um, how do I do that? Okay. All right. This one, no. You don't like this one? Maybe not. Can I grab the candle? No. Don't. Who the hell keeps opening doors? Around. Okay. I lighted the candles. What next? I think I'm supposed to light this one as well, but I don't. It doesn't allow me to do it. There's no missions. I don't know what to do. <laughs> It doesn't allow me to, to turn on this one, so maybe it's not working that one, I don't know. It looks consumed, so maybe I don't have to light that one. So what next then? What do I do? Where do I go? Do I need to find more light, more candles or what? Alright, I don't know what to do next. Ooh. Okay. F. Oh man, this is creepy now. But it's not night, so I don't think I need that one. Right. Actually, I want to see here if there's anything. There might be something that I'm missing. There's some toys. Creepy mask. This dude is still here. Okay, good for you. I still think it has something to do with these candles. But I don't know why I can't turn on this one. Oh, wait. Maybe the, I need to take something from here? Oh, the sleeping bag. Ah. Okay, done. Need to prepare for the night. Okay. <clears throat> night one. Ooh. Uh, not up to sleep. The first night in the camp. Wait. Why can't we use my camera? Um... What's going on? Can I go back to sleep? Uh, oh, here's the camera. Okay. Oh, fucking hell, no. Uh, hello? Can you please leave me alone? Is anyone here? Oh, there's a bird. Hey birdie, what happened with you? Oh, there's multiple birds. How the hell did you get in here? Hmm. Oh. 
There's a old lady here. All right. It's creepy. Yeah, I know it's creepy. Uh, it's really creepy. Okay. So, was this mask here? I don't think that mask was was here. Holy shit! Do I want to go here? I don't really want to go there. <laughs> All right, be brave. Be brave. It's just a game, okay? It's just a game, guys. Please don't jump on me. Anything, please, 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 please. please. Creepy, creepy mask. Oh, I'm not home. I'm not home. Who's opening doors? And why are you opening doors? Where the hell are these doors? Someone it's opening doors somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Okay, whatever. Okay, anyone here? No. There's a hammer with some nails. I guess those are the ones that I used to lock myself inside like a fucking idiot. For no reason. Close this door, please. Yeah, close the door. I don't I don't really want to to deal with this shit. I don't know what's going on here. Who's walking around? Kids? Are those kids? Is it me? Or is the doll? Maybe it's the doll. That creepy doll is running around, right? Do I have unlimited battery for this camera? Or is it gonna stop soon? And I'm gonna end up on the darkness. Okay, let's see. There's a can, which I guess someone moved it. The the creepy doll here. Mat what is called? Matryushka? I can't remember the name of that doll. Ah, it's you. Ah. Please, for fuck's sake, leave me alone. Why are you running around? What's wrong with you? I mean, if this is not evidence of paranormal, I don't know what it is, right? When you see a doll that is moving around, this should be enough evidence for me. Oh my god. Who closed the door? No! No, please. I'm gonna stay in this corner here. If you see a fucking doll moving around, that should be enough evidence for you to just leave this fucking place, right? You don't need to stay five nights in here. Oh, the doll is disappeared again. You see? You see? You don't need five days here. That's it. You saw it. All you need to do now, just open the door, please. Open the door. I don't want to open the door for me. You just open the door and... Oh! the fuck happened? Fucking hell, it scared the shit out of me. Uh, there's a phone. Oh, fuck no. No, no, no. Um. Oh, why is, th why is this door open? Why are these doors open? This one is closed. Um. Little girl? Is this the girl that, that killed all those kids? She came from the all wet and in her pajamas or stuff like that. Okay, we need to go and answer the phone because maybe it's the police uh, looking for us and uh, I need to answer the phone. Can you please be good? 
Stop. You were hit on the head, an uninvited guest. Oh my god, my head. Yeah, I know. Okay, now now is the time for you to leave, bro. Alright? Wait, what the hell? Oh, where am I? The next morning. I need to find my video camera. Of course you have to. Oh, this is the... Okay. It's the room that was closed. Alright, I guess we're gonna look for the camera, right? Oh my god, this this fucking game, bro. Uh, hey, pigeon. What's this? I can't read what it says. I need to get my Russian English. Wait, I, I had the Russian English dictionary. Why? What happened with my... Oh, the little girl. Maybe she was like, you know what? You don't need to speak my language. You don't need to know what I'm saying. So maybe now I have to go and find the dictionary again. Okay, whatever. Oh. I don't know. Uh, this is... Uh, what's, what's her name? Mother Mary? Mother Mary, can you please come and help me? We have a picture. You know what? I think we used to have in Romania something like this. Some of these pictures on uh, on some books. Where there was like a kid uh, reading and writing and a woman next to him. We had something like this when I was a kid. Obviously in Romania in that time when I was a kid it was right after the communism. So, you know, we had some of these uh, crappy uh, problems that were happening back in that time anyway let's not talk about that shit uh let's see what's what's going on here oh so someone removed the planks and they put them nice and neatly here good good for you holy fuck what's that is that a body a carcass okay i guess this is not the room where i have to go or i want to go actually not just okay uh my video camera yes Yes, please, take my video camera. Come on. I can't read what it says. I need to get my Russian... Okay. I will get... Oh, this is... I don't... Wait. Who's breathing? Is it me? Someone is breathing near me. I'm honestly not very curious on who is it. You're not welcome here. Uh, why not? I haven't done anything bad. The one who hit me on the head took the candle. I have to figure out what's going on here. Okay. You don't need to figure out, dude. You need to get the fuck out of here, bro. Come on. You know, that would be a great, <laughs> you know, a great option as a, for a horror game. So imagine if that was an option for you, you know, you play the game and then you decide to just leave the game whenever you want without getting through the whole story, right? That would be a good option. Because um, honestly, if I had the option right now to open this door and leave, I would do it. <laughs> I don't want to be here anymore. Again, I don't see what, what other evidence do you need. Uh, okay. Um, you see a doll moving? You got hit in the head by someone? Just just leave, you know? Like, there, there's no need to be here. This is the same picture that I watched already. Let me hold, keep this one open like this so I can see better. The doll is still there. Oh, there was something that I was trying to read, right? I was in that room. Um, who the hell is singing? Someone 
it singing here somewhere? It sounds like up here somewhere. Is it you? Is it outside? I don't know, it stopped singing. Okay, that was creepy. I don't want to... Maybe it was in this room. Right. Let's... Uh, let's search here for a second, see what we can find. The pioneer is ready to help the kid without further ado. All right, good, good for you. Oh, another creepy doll here. There's a lot of medicine here. Whoever was sleeping in this uh, bunk bed had a lot of problems. Hey, you're making too much noise. You need to fuck off. All right, what says here? Late at night, when people fall asleep, no need for fun and no need for a fool. And the beds are empty, and the eyes are full of bitterness, and the, the courtiers do not know what that fun means to the fool. The fool decides that enough is enough, and be that night wearing a, bad, a sad suit. Poisons the court and the king. I'm sad at heart, but the plan is not a failure. The fool will no longer be for fun for you. I know what the fuck, is this a poetry or something? That's really bad poetry. Whatever. Um, again, someone keeps opening doors somewhere. I'm not sure who and why and where. There's nothing here. Alright. Anything here in this mess? Not really. I'm not sure what I'm looking for. I think I need to find something. Some of these books, maybe? Oh, wait. I'm actually removing this shit now. Do I really want to do this? Come on, you can do it. Okay, there's a lot of footprints all over the place. Holy shit, yeah, I know. There's a dead body or animal or something. Need to look this room. Need to look. Ooh. It doesn't work. Need to find the fuse. Okay. So there's hands and footprints everywhere. The hands look big. Almost like a, an adult, not a kid. The director of the pioneer camp, you know, uh, Maria, whatever, disappeared like the rest of the camp workers. Maria had previously taken care of the children in an orphanage from 1944 to 1950. She was a caregiver who devoted herself only to work. Discipline was the most important to her, so the parents entrusted their children to her. All right. Another uh, dead bird here, Two, three of them actually. Uh, what do I say? Be clean, neat, pioneer. Show an example of everything. Okay, I will be clean. I will clean this place with fire. Yeah, yeah, let's clean this place with fire, guys. Let's burn this shit. Alright, where, where would the fuse be? Right? Let's uh, take a look at this. Here. Looks like an animal, doesn't look like human, right? No, I don't think it's human. Or at least I hope it's not human. Okay. Ooh. Okay. We got everything from that box. What's here? It'll, it'll take the. Ah no, that was the for the box with the with the stuff. Okay. That this one looks like uh, from outside somewhere, right? Okay. All right. Good. Let's go. Let's go put this fuse and turn on the lights here because. I haven't finished looking around the room. Is there anything else I do? I have to do here. Ooh! One day a girl came to the camp with a stuffed uh, hair toy. She went everywhere with him and even slept with him. The guys uh, began to mock her that she came with her favorite bunny as a little girl and made fun of her. Even the director asked to hide the hair 
in the closet so that uh, there will be no disagreement among peers. The girl listened to her and put the uh, hair in the locker and in the coming night the hair came, back, came to life. He was offended by his mistress and uh, those who mocked her and strangled every, everyone at night. Holy shit. Man, I keep pressing the escape button. All right. So that little bunny, uh, it's actually killing people, right? I, I, I have to take the whole box with me. That, that's why I couldn't leave. All right. I uh, need to take the box to the sleeping bag. That's exactly what I intend to do. Obviously, as long as there's no one here. Um... Okay, I don't know what happened, but I'm okay with that. I don't, I don't really want to see what what happens around me. Yeah, so I'm at the sleeping bag. So what do I do now? Do I put it here? Ah, okay. Let's take the fuse. All right, turn on the light. Uh, the light is in the other room, right? So I'm guessing now that I've done some stuff here because that's how games work, right? These horror games. You do something and then something happens. So I'm guessing now there's gonna be something happening around me. Yeah, because I need to go in that room to turn on the light. So let's see. Okay. The lights turn on without any major problems we have uh, music ah the music was coming from here was someone talking in the radio I don't really want to listen to that creepy music, honestly. Um, okay. I haven't seen the bunny anywhere. Where the hell is the bunny? The bunny looks like uh, he's the killer of those kids, right? He killed all those kids in their sleep. So... Maybe I shouldn't look for the bunny, <laughs> actually. Now that I'm thinking. Okay, what's my next, uh, my next objective here? What the hell do I need to do? We have lights. I need to go to bed. It'll be dark soon. All right, guys. So I think I'm going to end this episode here. Um, I don't want to go through the night and everything because, like I said, this is the first episode and I'm going to make like at least maybe three, two, three. I don't know how long this game is. Um, I'm having quite a lot of fun with this game <laughs> so far. And um, yeah, ho hopefully in the next one is going to be something more uh, scarier <laughs> happening. Not that so far it hasn't been scary, right? Um, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. If you want to become members of my channel, just press the join button and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.